I did a note it on, uh, you call it um, LBDA, Lake Basin Development Authority. Authority yes. Yeah? He constructed what? A supermarket? At a what? A hotel? As we speak today, we know that there are some monkey business concerning the Lake Basin Mall in Kisumu. Those Chinese used only 5,000 shillings. 5,000 <laughs> shillings. And they were paid 3.8 billion. And the board gave them the title deed. Yeah? And it was crafted as a PPP. They gave to get the title deed so they can give the Chinese. Secretly, the government, the people in Jubilee, they are having a plan to sell it. They advertised for that PPP. People applied, but the Chinese came very late. They postponed for opening the tenders and hotels yes. because of the Chinese. He came there and he bought, uh, he bought the tender by five last century. When he said his tender, submitted his tender, he, he, he wrote a letter which now changed the whole of the tender the tender and he was awarded so in his conditions mm -hmm. he had said that um, and he wrote even in the agreement mm -hmm. the lawyers of the meeting wrote the agreement and he said that now they, they should be given the title for the LBD it doesn't belong to the title the of, the of the fraud yeah it's based in Xumu isn't it yes you know where the LBD is yes. that title now for that LBD to, give, to be given to the Chinese, which he used and they went got a loan. The contract was uh, for about 2.5 billion to construct So they the took a loan for, with using Yes, the they were given a title and they got a loan of 2.5 billion from cooperative bank. The bank gave them a revolving loan. Revolving so loan. Okay, what is this revolving loan? When you're given a loan of 2.5, it's automatic. 2.5. Revolving. Oh my god. So long as title you Yes. Revolving. They revolved five times. 2.5 times 5. 12.5. Yes. 12.5 billion. This is an estate called what? Oh, here is the river. Yeah, the river. What do you call it? They use the same money. Just <laughs> there. There is another one somewhere here, and they constructed those estates. Which they sold and make money. Of course, yes. So where did we lose money? Uh, that's what I'm, I'm attracted to. Yeah. Where did we lose money as kids? They were given a title to borrow. Secure. As a security. Oh, as a security. Now, who, as a security. Who, 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 this title hmm. is in whose who's name? It is with the LBD name. Okay. So they have been given as a guarantee to borrow. Okay. So now they are using this loan to construct the estate and constructing the, the hotel and uh, they are billing and being paid. You know when you are given a contract, isn't it? Yes. You use your money. Yes. You are using your money, then you are paid. Isn't it? Yes. You earn what is? Uh, on top. Now I'm getting yes. I'm getting so, so finally, yes. they never even repaid their own. Huh? They used some clauses there. Then their loan liability was shifted to Lake Benson. Lake Benson. Lake Benson. The leaders claimed that the project was accumulating interest at a staggering rate of 145 million shillings per day, over and above the principal amount, and asked the Ministry of Devolution and Planning to quickly release the funds owed to Cooperative Bank. So the basin came to Treasury and uh, requested to be given money to, to pay. pay that loan. And now the budget was made and our MPs passed that budget. Wakibita, Wakipitisha, Grezwanga. Give the money. Then it goes to Treasury. Treasury 
Please are very funny character and says they have given the LBDA a loan. And you know LBDA it is not a, a generate it doesn't generate revenue. Yes. You know, it depends on treasury. Allocation. So Allocation. And you see now this loan they are being given, it's they are being given on the basis that the, the supermarket and Hotel. The hotel will make money to pay. Now, the last time China was China. Yeah? China or China? Ah, China, I'm here. 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 There is evident dilly dallying on the part of the Ministry of Devolution and Planning to have this project handed over and make it operate. Parliament had set aside 1.6 billion shillings in the current budget to enable Lake Basin Development Authority repay part of the 2.5 billion shillings borrowed to construct the ultra-modern shopping mall. However, the ministry has reportedly not remitted the same to COP Bank. We are aware that part of the reason why they are delaying is to make the loans which are accruing on, a, on every single day to accrue to, the le to, a le to a level that the financing institution would have to resort to auctioning the property to recover its money. People who are well placed, who are very highly placed within the Jubilee administration, would be able therefore to buy this property at a throwaway price. We are aware that there are people who have already lined up to do so. So you see now, apparently from the 5,000 shillings, yes. they used to buy the tender, they never used even another coin.